everybody on here and I'm door dashing today so hopefully it's gonna be a good day I've had a couple days that were not too bad at all so I don't know we're gonna see if this is gonna get any better this is earlier today I'm here I got here at about 8 30 they said it was super busy and uh, I haven't got my first order yet but it is picking up I think I'm gonna be able to make enough money to pay my lot fee which is 200 it's due today but I called him and told him I was gonna be late um, so that's okay and so, yeah, yesterday I got to deliver some flowers, which was pretty cool. Um, and so I guess they, they're branching out into maybe alcohol sales, too. I'm not sure. I'm game for anything. But um, the first couple days, I got nothing but $5 orders, which was a pain in the ass. Seriously, $5. One of them, I had to go like eight miles, and that was crazy for 5 bucks. But um, then I started getting some $6 orders, some $7 orders, $8 orders, and that adds up pretty quickly. So hopefully I'll be able to get, you know, um, a couple high dollar orders today. But um, yeah, it's getting better. So if any of you have been praying out there for me, thank you so much. It, it, it has helped. It absolutely has helped. I can feel it. So let's just keep our fingers crossed that today is going to be good. All right, I'm on my first order, and it's for Chick-fil-A, and I gotta tell you, the manager in there is a piece of work. Um, my DoorDash bag had broken, so I've been using a different bag, a different freezer bag, um, my Postmates bag, <laughs> that I've got zero orders from. Anyhow, she says, do you have your bag? And I'm like, I have a bag. And I, I don't know, I asked her, you know, when she came to finally give me my order, that, um, you know, do dashers come in here without their bags? I've noticed a lot of dashers don't bring their bags in. And, and you know, it's freezing dang cold outside. Yeah, I'm bringing my bag in. Anyhow, so I'm on my way to deliver it. And uh, it's not a big order, but I was right by the restaurant. And um, the drop-off is very close. So four bucks, who cares? It'll be fine. See this face? It is not a happy face. DoorDash just sent me to a merchant that wasn't even there. So I have no idea where they were wanting me to go, but there wasn't a sub shop at this address. So I figured out how to decline an order once I had accepted it, and that's what I did. And this, you see this smile, it's fake. <laughs> So I'm not getting a whole lot of orders this time, but it's only like 1040, so hopefully the day will get better. I'm going to think positive. The day is young. Here's my nostrils. That's a nostril shot. I'm bored. Can you tell I'm bored? Very bored. Well, at least I can get caught up on my YouTube videos, you know, watching my the people that I subscribe to because I've not been able to watch because where I live, there's no internet. <laughs> God. Check out my waddle. <laughs> hey, a $7.18 order from Chili's, so I'm on it. Okay, that was awesome. Chili's is the best place to pick up stuff from. They're always very quick. Whoops, except another one. Oh, no way, Jose. Ah, that was from Chick-fil-A. I don't want to go back to that store. The manager there is not very nice and just no. But Chili's, Chili's is awesome. They're quick. They're nice. Um, the deliveries, the orders are usually, you know, $7 or higher. So, yeah, right on Chili's. Chick-fil-A. Well, my last delivery was for Wendy's, five bucks. It was close. And you know what? I'm, I'm throwing in the towel for today. I think we're gonna have to try again. Well, I'm off tomorrow. I work Saturday all day long. And the van's making some funny sounds, so <laughs> I hope it's nothing. So I'm gonna get her home and see if I can get somebody to look at it and uh, try again tomorrow. And that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.